Welcome to the IS24 Virtual Family Science Day. I'm Ms. Zinna, seventh grade science teacher, and I'm so excited to be here bringing you one of the investigations you see at our annual event. Our testable question is, does the amount of water affect the consistency of the oobleck? Another word for consistency is viscosity. That is the flow of a fluid or its substance, which would be fast or slow. The independent variable is the factor that you change to see what effect it has, whereas the dependent variable is what you are measuring. The constants are the factors we keep the same. The independent variable is the amount of water. I have one cup of water in this glass, and I have one and a half cups of water in here. The dependent variable is the measure of the consistency of the oobleck. The constants are the bowls, measuring cups, the amount of corn starch, and food coloring. The materials that we're gonna be using are two bowls or containers, measuring cups, food coloring, one cup of water, and two cups of cornstarch. First, our safety procedures. Do not try this unless you have the permission of adult in your home. Wear protective goggles, gloves, and clothing. Make sure you have plenty of space outside to try this experiment. Procedure. You're gonna mix the two cups of cornstarch to the one cup of water into a bowl. Mix the cornstarch and the water slowly and add a little bit of water at a time. So here I have the two cups of cornstarch and the one and a half cups of water. Here I have two cups of cornstarch and one cup of water. Before I start, I'm going to add my food coloring first. So I'm just gonna add a few drops. We have the red food coloring, and now I'm gonna add the blue food coloring. Your mixture should be a solid if you squeeze it and turn it to a liquid when you release your grip. If you find the mixture is a little too watery and not forming into a solid, when you pull the oobleck out of your bowl, then add more cornstarch. If you find the mixture is not dripping like a liquid, add a little more water. Just keep experimenting until you find the consistency of oobleck. So now I'm gonna take the two cups of cornstarch and add it to my bowl. With the one and a half cups of water, so I'm gonna pour that slowly. Then I'm gonna move over and add my two cups of cornstarch. And now I'm gonna add the one cup of water. Now I'm gonna mix them together for a few minutes until it's evenly mixed. Then I'm gonna move over here and I'm gonna mix the cornstarch and the one and a half cups of water together. As you can see, the how the consistency is different as you're adding the different amount of water. So what are the science concepts? Oobleck isn't actually a liquid or a solid. It's a non-Newtonian fluid. 
So at times it may seem like a solid or a liquid, but it acts differently than a normal solid or a liquid. A non-Newtonian liquid, uh, I should say fluid, is a fluid in which the viscosity, the way it flows fast or slowly, changes with pressure. So non-Newtonian fluids, uh, viscosity is low with pressure and fast when there is no pressure. Ketchup is another example of a non-Newtonian fluid. Thank you for viewing our wacky science experiment. We hope you had as much fun as we did. If you do try this at home, please send us a video so you can post it on our IS24 Instagram account. Thank you.